Hi, this is Lisa Fain, CEO of Center for Mentoring Excellence and co-author of Bridging Differences for Better Mentoring. This morning as I was tidying my office, I spied this book on my shelf, Strengths Finders by Tom Rath. It's a favorite of mine and years ago I took their assessment on what my top five strengths were and I often use this with my own clients as well. And it reminded me that I wanted to talk today about a concept called appreciative inquiry in mentoring, which is really a strengths-based approach. So what's appreciative inquiry? Well, let me first tell you what it's not. So often we look, we think about what we want to be working on and we form our goals around a deficit-based approach. We think about what's not working. We think about where things are broken. And instead, a strengths-based approach, an appreciative, an approach that uses appreciative inquiry, thinks about what is working and what builds upon our strengths. Instead of saying what's what don't I like about what's happening or what do I want to be different? We think about what sh what could things be? What should things be? Sometimes this approach is referred to as discover, dream, and design. And I love that concept. I especially love that concept for mentoring partners where you really can take the time in this trusting relationship to discover where your strengths are, to dream about possibility, and then to design an ideal future. So think about that next time you're in your mentoring relationship. Not about what's not working, but about what's working well. Happy mentoring.